change the past, but you can learn from it. Are you ready to live your life now in the present? <laughs> Black Friday is over, and binge-watching Netflix is back again with a stunning release of Scrooge, A Christmas Carol. But what makes the movie stand out? And who are the incredible talents behind the voices? Let's find out in the video. Good day, ladies. <laughs> How rude! Hi guys, and welcome back to our channel. I'm excited to introduce you to the people who bring Scrooge to life the voice actors behind this classic tale. For those who don't know, Scrooge A Christmas Carol is an anime based on a classic story by Charles Dickens. It follows the main character, Ebenezer Scrooge, on his journey toward being a better person after being visited by three ghosts who show him what life would have been like if he had never been born. Before starting the video, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to like the video. Let's get into it. My father, he was not a poor man, the fool spent his way into debtor's prison. <gasps> Scrooge, voiced by Luke Evans. In the film, Luke Evans provided the voice of Ebenezer Scrooge. His character is a self-centered miser whose Christmas Eve is interrupted by ghostly visitors. Evans was born in Wales and has acted, voiced, and sung professionally in many movies. He first gained recognition in Broadway shows like Rent, Miss Saigon, and Piaf. Clash of the Titans was the first film that launched his career and he also appeared in Ravens, The Immortals, and The Three Musketeers. The Three Musketeers. Also, Evans has played pivotal roles in Fast and Furious 6, Beauty and the Beast, The Hobbit, and Dracula Untold. Luke has tried to give his best while performing for the character, as it was a blend of harsh and polite personalities in the same movie. Critics have claimed that no actor's voice has worked better for the role. And to have in my pocket and throw in a little bit of cratchit magic, I reckon we can have as fine a Christmas as the Lord Mayor himself. Yeah! Bob Cratchit, voiced by Johnny Flynn. Scrooge also features a character, Bob Cratchit, whose voice is provided by Johnny Flynn. The character works as a clerk in Scrooge's office and desires to spend Christmas with his family by requesting time off for the holiday. Uh, Mr. Scrooge! Oh dear, I, oh, welcome back, sir. There's something I should tell you. However, this is something that his boss frowns upon. Flynn is a well-known British actor, as well as a singer and songwriter. He has portrayed David Bowie in the movie Stardust and starred as Dylan Witter in the television comedy Love Sick, which aired on Channel 4 and is now available on Netflix. Alongside Anya Taylor-Joy, Bill Nighy, and Josh O'Connor, the actor has also appeared in the film adaptation of Jane Austen's novel Emma which was directed by Autumn DeWild and starred Josh O'Connor. Emma. Mr. Knightley. This is your doing. She is the natural daughter of nobody knows. Sorry, Mr. Gentleman, and a gentleman in Emma was based on the novel of the same name by Jane Austen. Oh, come now, Uncle. Hella and I would just love to have you. Hella, my wife. She was so disappointed you couldn't attend the wedding. Harry Huffman, voiced by Froffy. Harry Huffman is Ebenezer Scrooge's only living relative and Froffy lends his voice to the character of Harry Hoffman. Uncle, I'm all the family you have. Why does it have to be this way? Despite Scrooge's cold attitude toward him, the character is a kind-hearted giver who adores his uncle and lavishes affection on him at every opportunity. Froffy is best recognized for his performance as Krefirak in the movie version of Les Miserables, which was released in 2012, and for his roles in the television series Cinderella on Amazon and Hawkeye on Marvel. Froffy also comes from a background in theater, and his stage credits include roles in productions such as Dirty Dancing, Aladdin, Romeo and Juliet, As You Like It, and West Side Story. There is no going back, nor changing what has been. You said so yourself. You can't change the past. Past, voiced by Olivia Colman. The Ghost of Christmas Past is voiced by Olivia Colman and has the appearance of a shape-shifting wax figure candle. She travels through Ebenezer Scrooge's life on various Christmases, beginning when he was a child and continuing into his early adulthood. Scrooge is teased by the ghost of Christmas past, who has a sense of humor and is very compassionate. She makes fun of him for being miserable. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. You can't interfere with anything here, and nobody can hear you. But she also encourages him to change his ways and find happiness. She's known for her roles as Carol Thatcher in The Iron Lady, Hildegard Schmidt in Murder on the Orient Express. Yes. Each one that dies, a little bit of you goes with them. 
Queen Anne in The Favorite, for which she won an Academy Award, Godmother in Fleabag, Prisoner Zero in Doctor Who, and Sarah Nelson in Heartstopper. Coleman co-stars with Scrooge co-star Jonathan Price in season five and six of Netflix's Crown. Can I talk to you? Alone? Not now, Isabel. I have far too much work. Isabel Fezziwig, voiced by Jesse Buckley. Jesse Buckley provided the voice of Isabel. This character is Scrooge's ex fiancee and she appears in flashbacks that are presented to Scrooge by the ghost of Christmas past. Buckley is a singer and actress who hails from Ireland. She began her career by competing on the talent show I'd Do Anything, which airs on BBC television, and she finished in second place. The actress has been nominated for an Academy Award and the Lawrence Oliver Award, which she has won. Jesse Buckley for Cabaret at the Kit Kat Club at the Playhouse Theatre. In addition, in 2020, she was included on the list compiled by the Irish Time of Ireland's greatest film actors. Buckley's acting resume also includes roles in shows such as War and Peace, The Woman in White, and The Lost Daughter. We were all like you, trapped in our own selfish worlds. We never reached out to our fellow men in life. Jacob Marley, voiced by Jonathan Price. Sir Jonathan Price, a member of the cast of The Crown seasons 5 and 6, provides his voice for the character of Jacob Marley in Scrooge, A Christmas Carol. Dead tired. <laughs> Marley was Ebenezer's late business manager and former employee. Marley was a miser throughout his life until the end, and Ebenezer Scrooge modeled his own life after Marley's to achieve the same level of financial stability. A long list of notable roles that Jonathan Price has played includes Governor Weatherby Swan in the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise. At once. Do you hear me? Governor Weatherby Swan, it's been too long. Cut your back. Elliot Carver in Tomorrow Never Dies, Cardinal Jorge Mario Bergoglio in The Two Popes, for which he received an Oscar nomination, and The High Sparrow in Game of Thrones. Price was also knighted in 2021. Can you feel it, Scrooge? Are you ready to live your life now, in the present, unencumbered by the weight of the past? So there you have it all. With this, I think it's time to wrap up the video. But before leaving, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video. Let us know in the comment section below who's your favorite actor in the movie. See you in the next video. So, you are the one that will show me what awaits if I do not change my ways. Yes? Well, goodbye, Ebenezer Scrooge.